Hey, you guys. I'm here with Spencer. Spencer is showing us how to add cards to our uh, or our Trello project management cards to our website. He already added one, so he's going to go through it one more time for us and add another card. So take it away, Spencer. All right. So to recap what we did is we're going to go to Add. We're going down to the More function that's at the very bottom. And you can do either Embed a Site or HTML code, but it's honestly just less work to do the HTML code because it automatically opens up when you enter the code to access what you need. Uh, and so you're going to your Trello, you're going to click on the card that you want to put in, and you're going to hit share and more. And down at the second option is the embed this card. And you'll uh, copy that and put that right there where you want to put your code. And that shows up there. Resize this. And a few of the options that you can also do with this is if you want to allow people to comment, you'll go over to the menu on the far right side underneath your um, name icon, and you'll go to more and settings. That automatically opens to settings. Go down to menus. And so right now I have commenting permission set to public, but you can set it to just members. So what it means is if it's set to public, then um, my anybody that views the cards could actually do it. Eric, would you refresh it and do it? Anybody in this world can leave a comment on your particular card. Is that accurate? Yep. And right there you see that Eric was able to comment on my card right here. Because is he a member or is he just, uh, he's just public? Right? It, because it's public. But since I am I am one of the members of the card as well as the person who I'm working with, Tyler, uh, we are able to delete his comment. Um Members. And if you don't want any commenting, you can put it on disabled, but unless you have a member of your group that's honestly abusing the commenting, there's no really need to turn off comments. You would hope your old members would not abuse your commenting, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, but I, that's a good thing. If you have other members as part of your team, uh, that is a great thing to turn on so that way you guys can comment on, hey, how are you doing? But if you are on your Wix site and you click on it, it will open up to the Trello board and automatically open the card for you. So open the card. So people, let's open that card one more time for me, Spencer. So obviously if you click that, uh, it opens the card. So you personally can see, uh, you know, kind of where you're at with uh, what you need to do with all the different development things. I got some data up there. You got some music and some memories here and just some different things that you could be working on. So that's always nice. So again, these companies can see that you are working in an organized fashion to get your development done before the 21st. Kind of what your goal is to get done before the 21st. Maybe not the entire thing, but uh, that is our goal right now with that. Uh, very cool. And another thing is that even though it's posted on your website and the commenting is public, people are unable to check off anything for you. So they can only see the work that you have checked off. That's a good thing. <laughs> you don't want the public to be checking off things. So they can do that. 